Guys, welcome to our fourth Arsenal update video. This is a video where we show you every single airsoft, BB gun, anything like that we've collected. There are some we've either given away, but for the most part, we try to keep most of them. After this video, that is gonna stop. We have way too many. We're gonna have to start giving away or getting rid of some of the older airsofts that we did when we first started the channel. After doing all of these, do you have a favorite? Um, yeah, actually. But only pick one we've made a video about. I say that because right over here yeah. is our vaulted area. Okay. I'm gonna do my best to blur this out. Most of them are just the videos we haven't done because they're upcoming. So if you wanna see that, stick around to the very end of the video. Which one was your favorite? Robot. That is your favorite one. Yeah, it's so clean. If you've been watching with us long enough and you don't wanna see all the stuff that you've seen already three times, then you can go ahead and skip ahead to the chapters that you want. All right, dude, you ready? Get right to it. This is some of our earliest stuff before we even had a YouTube channel, right? Yeah. All right, so we had this one. It was given to him. We don't know a model number. We have, uh, I used to call it a Red Rider, and that is a Red Rider. A lot of y'all have corrected me and told me this possibly might be a buck. These two right here, we actually bought for Riker's sister, right? Yeah. This is the P99 Walther Springer. And we we have this P2. 777. Sniper rifle. This is UK Arms, guys. I know. We know, we know, we know. This is a trash brand. We bought this uh, right when we started the channel just to give us something to do, I think. Now we have PPQ. the Walter PPQ. This is the one that has these uh, suppressor and the glow in the dark BBs, extra set of magazine. This is that kit. Next, we have the FN Scar. Uh, this is a good springer. The next in line is SIG MPX. This is the Uzi. This is our first AEG. It's actually one of those low powered AEGs, but that was our first one. This is the uh, Colt M4 1911 Ops kit. Everything from there, guys, that was our first Arsenal update, minus a couple that we ended up giving away. Now everything from here forward is gonna start the second update video we had. This is the Barra. It's a 1911. This is a Springer BB pistol. Next, we have the Breda PX4 Storm. This is the Colt M45A1 CO2 powered, non-blowback. Next up, we have the Crossman C11. This is a BB pistol, CO2 powered, the L86A2. This is a Springer. Next, we have the Brodak BB pistol on this one. This one's actually broken. We just put it out here because it's really cool, right? Yeah. This was the electric blowback HKP30. I really like this one. This is the Glock 19 non-blowback CO2 powered. Next up, we have the XBG. This is a CO2 powered non-blowback. This one shoots at steel BBs also. This is the SIG 1911 Spartan. This was our first blowback, wasn't it? Yeah, this was my first real AEG. I was actually surprised how inexpensive this Lancer was. Slightly under $200. We got a complete kit. Okay, so, so the next up, dude, is this one right here. Do you remember which one this is? HK. HK, 416, good job. Now, what is this? MK45. This is the Mark 45. This is a BB pistol. I love this one, those fiber optics. Which one you got right there? This one. That is the Game Face. This is game another AEG. 76, my favorite Barra. The Barra is next. That is a BB pistol. That's the one that's got the real looking cartridges in it too. Next up, this is the Walther P99. It shoots like a half blowback. Right, next up is, what is it? Uh, a Barra 1866. That is right, Barra model 1866. Guys, this is such a beautiful rifle. Barra actually sent this to us. Huge shout out to those guys once again. Next up oh, is. God, Glock 19, airsoft version, uh, again, non-blowback. And then next we have the Desert Eagle. Uh, this is a blowback, fully automatic, semi-automatic. Yeah. All right, show us that next one. Cause that, so this is a Springer pistol. And then this one right here, check that out. Bolt action sniper. All right, now we have the 6XP. This is a airsoft blowback CO2 powered. Uh, this, is, this was a good one, half blowback model. Next one, what is it? HK40. HK416. This is CO2 powered, semi-auto, six round burst. This one was really good. 
Next up, we have the TAC 1911 from Elite Force. This is our uh, CO2 powered blowback airsoft pistol. This one right here, we have the FN. First and only LMG we have. This is the M249 Para Para. I don't really know how you say it. We're starting Arsenal update number three, the HFC gas powered 1911. Uh, this is green gas. Next one, what do we got? We have the G&G &G Firehawk. It's one of my favorites. Now, what is the next one? Uh, yeah, I don't know. This is the Colt. I think it's another M45. Yes, yeah, M45 CQBP. What's the next one then? You should know this one. Glock 19X. Glock 19X. This is green gas blowback. Next one, we're gonna go in threes because we did it, I think, around the same, maybe even in the same video. Red Rider. Red Rider, the Bullseye, and then 1977 Winchester. So these are all BB guns. We have steel BB gun, lever action, steel BB gun, lever action. This is actually pump action, and it's BB and pellet on that one. I knew he wasn't gonna remember any of these names. Moving on, what do we got? This is the uh, Elite Force M4 CQB. This is a really nice kit, I like this one. This one had the smart charger inside of it. Next up, we have the Barra. Barra actually gave us this one also, just like they gave us all the other ones. And they actually gave us that extra to do the giveaway, remember? Bulldog. Bulldog is the next in line. This is another M4 model, uh, AEG. Next up, we have Glock 18C. Uh, this is full auto, green gas, 50 round magazine. All right, next the up, half blowback model of the Glock 19X uh, Airsoft, CO2 powered. Now we have the Crossman Vigilante. Is this Airsoft or is this BB? BB? This is BB? Okay, Riker says this is BB. Oh yeah, see? Airsoft has a thing. Yeah, Airsoft has a thing, you're right. And this is our first pistol that was a pellet only. That was really different. Wait, this, this was the P, yeah, P320. This was a pellet only pistol. Next up is the Ripcord. This was a good one from Game Face. Moving on, the SIG P365. Yeah, next up is the Galaxy. I love this pistol. Full auto, semi-auto. You can throw the tracer on this thing. It's green gas. It's really, really nice. Now, this was our first shotgun. The STF-12 pump action. That was a really, really cool one. I like it. Next up is the High Kappa. This is our very first one. This is in uh, Army Armament uh, R501. This is a very beautiful pistol right there. My favorite one. This is the Lancer Tactical Battle X. Favorite AR. In a year and a half, 18 months, roughly, that's all we did. Everything right there. Now you ready to start the next one? This is all the newest stuff, guys, from the last update. So if you skipped ahead just to this point, well then, welcome to this part of the video. Are you ready? Yeah. This is the Smith & Wesson R8. This is when we actually went to EVIC when they had their grand opening, remember? Oh, that was yeah. really fun. So we got the R8 revolver. The next one, we have, don't even get me lying, I know this is the AK something, but this is a cool shotgun type airsoft green gas. And this is the spring model uh hk mp7 that's a beautiful beautiful airsoft yeah, springer go ahead all right next up is we have some springer models we'll go through these real quick we have some beretta m9 springers we have this colt uh 1911 springer we have these colt twin pack these are actually pretty new you just clicked ahead to this part of the video and you're expecting something amazing ha jokes on you all right next up kane from a battle video, uh, we actually bought these at a shopping vlog, at least that one we did. Uh, this one was given to us by Evic. They actually sent that one to us. Thank you, Evic, uh, for that one right there. You have the Battlemaster and the CMO22A, AKs, okay. AEGs, low-powered AEGs. Basically the same thing. One's just a tacked out version. The other one's just the traditional version. Basically which, the same thing, right? But you would think this was the last one. Second to the last one, but it's not to the end of the video. This is the Thompson Model 1928, also known as the Tommy Gun. This is probably one of the most recent ones we did. Uh, AEG, uh, Airsoft. This is how you spin it. Moving on to the most recent video we have posted, right? A Remember a the walther p22 springer airsoft yes obviously it's not the most recent 
because by the time you've seen this video, it's gonna be another one from our vaulted area. This is the uh, recon pistol. What is this one? The AP-13. Oh, those are there. Yes. Uh, we have the Voodoo shotgun right here. We have this Colt M4A1 CQBR. Next up, we got the Firepower F4D. And down here we have the Mossberg. It's another shotgun. We have another recon, another recon, uh, another PPQ set. These are all for giveaways. Oh. We have pump action, BB gun air rifle, the Crossman uh, R1, the Fallen Patriot. Uh, we have this one I'm actually uh, filming right now. So I'm sure this is the one you've no. probably seen already. Filming. I mean, I'm editing, I'm sorry. Yeah, editing. I'm editing this one right now. And then we have this the one, AK-1. This one is literally- Brand fresh. new, we just got this. Yeah. Just if you want to see the property that Riker's actually talking about, check it out in the video on the screen, and we'll see you there. Later, guys.